My name is Artger Hugson and I'm going to introduce you to this instrument, the gitten. The gitten is a medieval plucked instrument and it is carved out a one piece of wood, the body, the neck and the headstock with attached soundboard. You have just heard a friend's dance from the second half of the 13th century an SMP played on this instrument with the bigger of my two gittens, with my D gitten. Next, you're going to hear an English dance which was properly written in Coventry in the 13th century, and that will be played on my smaller gitten, my G gitten. <laughs> we can see that gittens and other medieval instruments became in various sizes. There was in fact very little standardization in the medieval times. And gittens are depicted with everything from three, four or five courses 
or pairs of strings. The strings were made out of gut, but we know very little about the tuning for certain. I use tuning, which is mentioned in a 12th century manuscript, which tells us that they should be tuned in an octave, a fifth and a fourth, or in other words, open tuning. This enables me to use open strings to accompany the melody, similar to other instruments like the symphony of the medieval hurdy-gurdy, bagpipes and medieval fiddles or viels. The next piece is from the collection of songs called Cantigas de Santa Maria, which was compiled in late 12th century Spain. instruments in medieval times were played with a plectrum or a quill. This could be feathers or a horn or even bone and they make different sounds on the gittin as you can hear. can see from pictures that the players they hold the plectrum around about in this way which is quite good because you can adjust the strength of the pick. There isn't any instrument specific repertoire from the medieval period but we know that instrumentalists often borrowed vocal repertoire. The next piece you will hear is a vocal duet by Landini from the late 14th century and it's played on both my gittens. My little G gittin is on the soprano line and my D gittin is on the alto line.
both Magettans have got Icelandic sea eagle headstocks with Bruce Brook on my D-Gitten and Carlos Gonzalez on my D-Gitten made from a picture I sent them. Gitten players are often depicted playing for dancing and singing as well as playing in concert or ensemble. So I'm going to finish this video by inviting Emily Baines on the recorder to join me in playing another dance, a saltarello from late 14th century Italy. Thank you. 